The Inspire exhibition was intended to encourage more young men into sport in Hartlepool by showcasing young local athletes doing contemporary sports like slacklining, skateboarding. We wanted to see more participation throughout the community. So when I'm considering an exhibition, there would probably be three main areas that I would have to take into account. Firstly, the space that the exhibition is going to be in. The work has to blend with the environment, has to look like it was always meant to be there. Secondly, I, I think about the audience who is going to be looking at my work. What are they expecting to see? How can I do something beyond their expectations? And I think, thirdly, the, the theme of the exhibition, the story, that what am I trying to tell? What is the story I'm trying to tell? How can I engage with the people? Um, how can I keep them interested from the start to the finish? I started uh, at quite a poignant place, um, the baptismal font. Um, the idea was it was this new beginning, a new fresh start to people's lives. So I started there with, uh, in the same place where I would start my sculptures with a roll of wire, um, just the raw material and from that I wanted something to grow from it. We don't start anything in life with perfection, it takes time to get there and it was to try and show the build up of that. Right, so the long jump piece was, uh, was mounted on the wall. I decided for this installation that I would actually draw onto the walls as well. And the reason I did that was just to add another dimension. I drew straight onto the gallery walls. I didn't want to use anything in between, any paper or canvas. Uh, so there was an energy in that because I actually had to do as the exhibition was being set up. Lighting is not a separate element to my sculptures. It is very much a part of them. It helps the eye to focus on what is, for the most part, transparent figures. And not only that, it highlights the detail. And the nature of the metal means that it takes on the colour and seems to absorb it. And this gives me great freedom to create the look or the mood that I want. It's been an honour and a pleasure to have been involved in the Inspire project. And to feel that my sculptures may have had a positive influence on people, that they might have been a catalyst for change in someone's lifestyle is great. Children have sat here in the gallery drawing from the figures. They've had their eyes open to different ways of making sculpture. I use wire to express my art. And in the beginning, I came across many difficulties using it. But I guess the message in all of this is perseverance and a determination to achieve your potential, because only that will lead to fulfillment. <laughs>